Hello, I'm Orbator, and I decided to take up the Reddit challenge, Unstoppable, which was to use SRB rockets to go and get into orbit around the man, or hard mode, land on the man. So I thought, yeah, give her a go. Okay, this is my first attempt, and it failed, as you can see, we didn't even get the upper upper's height, and these rockets I'm frying here were meant for us to transfer the man. So second attempt. Okay, nice launch. Everything's working. A little overheat on the smaller ro solid rocket boosters, but nothing I can't handle. But again, the orbit is not perfect. Our orbit stage didn't get us into a circular orbit, so use the transfer stage again. I do get into a bit, but think. Let's try again. More boosters, please. And this doesn't work so well as I mistake here. Ah, oh, killing Jeb Dyer in the process. Not good. Another design, and I forget the space tape. Ooh, can we save Jeb by here? Let's give it a go. Fire, fire rockets. No, no, no. Oh, <laughs> too many stages, and we didn't fire them in time. Poor Jeb. But let's resurrect him and try again. Okay, another redesign. You can see the SRBs on the, the smaller SRBs on the outside on the bottom didn't have any struts, so we kept on spinning the rocket. And eventually we lose control. Oh, come on now. Alright, so I decide, let's stage this. See if we can save Jeb from this. Can we land safely? Okay, this, this part is the landing stage that we're supposed to use to land on the map. Now, this is a good test to see if we can use it to land on the Concurbin. It's got more than enough Delta V. Oh, no, I did decide to jettison there and use the SRBs, give them a test. Each one of them had about 72 meters per second. So, quick last ditch burn, and, whoa, I think we crashed at 21 meters per second, but we did survive. We tipped over, which is not good. On the man, you're not allowed to tip over, you have to stay upright. So anyway, we survived. And that's all Jeb has to say. Because he's going to try again. And again, I forget to put the struts on the outside SRBs. And I've forgotten at this point what happened to this. I think this was our fail attempt 8. No, this is 9. This is fail attempt 9. Okay, everything's going fine. No problems here. As you got that rotation, that was because I didn't place those winglets for control properly. Didn't place place them correctly. Oh, what are you going to do? Just re-engineer, I suppose. Anyway, carrying on with this, we're trying to get up into orbit. But apopsis height is too low. Okay, so let's use the transfer stage, which we're supposed to be using to get to the man. Let's get ourselves into orbit and see if we can salvage this at all. Because I've put enough Delta V on this rocket for us to get to the man, to get into orbit around the man, and to land. It was just the ascent stage. I was having trouble with the ascent stage. I do figure out in the end it's, it's a balance between your threats to weight ratio and your Delta V. Which I will find out in a later attempt. Anyway, we get ourselves into a very high orbit. And I think, oh, the moon's coming over there. Can we burn for it? Let's give it a go. So here we go, doing the moon, moon transfer burn. And will it work? What we got an intercept, a high speed intercept by the look of it. So we get there, we use the descend stage of the man rocket, and we do get ourselves into orbit. Yep, you can see there the orbit closing up. I think, oh, don't want to crash, don't want to crash. So I slow down the video and I stage, yee. <laughs> Destroying the capsule as we go, well, not the capsule, but destroying the rocket body as we go along. 
Okay, Jeb is stuck there. Well, that's fine. We've successfully completed the easy task of the Reddit challenge Unstoppable. But I was not happy. I wanted to land. So here we go again. And you see you've got a new design here. I think this is the third design of this type of rocket with the larger SRBs. And you can see in the middle on the bottom stage there. And obviously I needed to use the small SRBs on the side of that to give it enough thrust to weight ratio on that rocket. Now this challenge is hard because you need to balance that delta V, which is not too hard. You can just reduce the amount of propellant you got in it, but you cannot disengage the engine. You can't have that fine control. And that's what made the ascent stage hard because you had to get that. That ascent stage, you had to get it. Let me get my words right. They had to get yourself to get the ascent gravity turn just right in relation to the thrust to weight ratio of the rocket and the delta V. Okay, so now we are. We got our apapsis. We burnt a little early because this ascent stage, this final orbit stage, was going to take a longer burn. But we get into orbit, smashing the bottom rocket as we do. But anyway. Here we are, our man burn. As you can see, are we going to make it? Are we going to get there? Obviously, we're going to get there. I wouldn't have put this video up if we weren't. And you see by there, I think I was a bit flash. We were going to, we were going to intercept the man directly. Crash, I mean. But uh, fast forward through the uh, sphere of influence, and we did it. We got there, and we even got into orbit. Look at this. 7 kilometers by 52 kilometers. This is perfect. We're above the mountains. We're not going to crash. I was a bit worried about landing. So let's give it a go. Attempt number one. We burn too late. We crash. Oh, dear. Sorry, Jeb. Attempt number two. We're coming down, and I noticed we burnt a bit too early. Because now we're not going down fast enough. And this is going to get us going up. We're going to run out of fuel and crash. So I tried to get myself angled down, tried to control that speed using the orientation of the rocket. E okay, come on. Uh, no, not good, not good. Okay, down a bit more, and we're out of propellant. Okay, time to use the other SRBs. Whoops, I've used them. Ah, no. The small SRBs were supposed to be for the last ditch effort of the landing. Oh, we survived. Whoa, can we land on the remaining two legs? No, come on, orientate it properly now. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, yeah, we're going to get it, we're going to get it. We're going to do it, we're going to do it. No, 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 no. Oh. And Jeb dies. Never mind, we've got a third attempt. And I'm feeling lucky about this one. Yes, indeed. Come on, Jeb. You can do it. We're coming down. Again, we burnt slightly a bit early now. Well, late, I mean. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. So I decided to ditch him there. I think. Yeah, we're coming down slowly. We'll use the SRBs. No, we can't because we fired them. Uh, we're coming down. We're coming down. Oh, we're going to hit hard. Just over 20 minutes playing, but we landed on the land legs. Or is this classed as a slide? Can you only class a landing if you stopped? Interesting question. But we seem to be slide floating down there as when the SRBs crash into the pla into the moon, into the moon. Spreading his debris across. Anyway, we seem to be floating, so I'm not going to class as a landing until we stop. We do a bit of a tumble. Slide on the side. But we haven't stopped, so it's not landing yet. It's not a tip over landing. Come on, don't tip over. We don't want to stop it. And I realize at some point that it's the SAS. It's holding us at an angle. We're not getting enough friction on the ground. So switching the SAS off at should be about now we slow down yes that's what it was all the landing legs had to be on the ground to slow us down enough okay we've come to rest 
We've done it. We've landed on the man with just SRBs and a bit of luck. And Jebediah, of course. It would not have been a success without him. Anyway, he plants a flag. What will he say? Well, obviously, this is going to be a thing to us. Just change the... Let's change that caps lock. And Reddit challenge. Complete. Oh yes, this isn't called unstoppable, isn't it? And what text are we going to write to uh, I can't forget. I've forgotten what we're going to write to her. I'll have to lead it. Yes, slide landing. But was on... Landing legs, I believe. Yeah, that's right. I was on landing legs. One stopped. Should be counted as a landing. Well, I'll let you guys decide. Put it in the comments if you think you should class that as a successful landing. Because one of the hard mode challenge was that you had to land on the legs and no tip over. But I came to a stop when with the landing legs on my landing legs. So, anyway. Tell me about it. Let me know. And yes, I think it was a success. But that's you're the judge. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, subscribe and all that stuff. Like as well. I'm Orbiter. Trust me, I'm an engineer.